so let me tell you a bit about Cherry, uh, what we do, what we invest in, but also a bit about how, how I ended up becoming an investor, which was certainly more by coincidence. Um, I had a job uh, in New York, started there, um, spent quite some time in the US, got my MBA there, but then after some time decided it was actually a good time to come back to Europe, um, come back to Berlin. I'd following the scene very closely and I knew things were evolving really in Europe as well. And I thought, you know, if anything uh, is happening in technology, then it's probably going to be a worldwide thing and it's probably also a really good time to become an entrepreneur in Europe. And so that's what I did. I moved um, back to Berlin, uh, joined in with a friend of mine, and we worked really hard on building a business. And that's roughly four years ago now. And um, you know, we've certainly been through all the ups and downs. We've uh, raised quite some substantial amount of venture capital funding ourselves. But unfortunately, in the end, um, didn't succeed in building this very large company that we set out to build and uh, that was our ambition level. So, we thought, you know, we have to learn from our mistakes and have to move on. Uh, probably it's the best thing if we just move on and start another company. And um, then I left the last company. I sort of didn't really have an idea yet. And I met up with Philip, Christian, and Daniel, who uh, I knew were really active angels in Berlin and who had been successful entrepreneurs before. And I thought, I'll talk to them and discuss um, a couple ideas. And then they told me that they were also starting something new. But uh, to my surprise, it actually wasn't a company. It was a VC fund, and um, at first, um, you know, I wasn't really sure what to think about that, but then they told me that they see this opportunity to really build the most entrepreneurial early stage fund in Europe. And I thought, well, it's actually great if these guys say this because, you know, they've been scaling massive marketing and sales organizations like Groupon and Zalando before, and um, they've been involved in building category leaders such as Quandu and and Salandro. So I thought, if this resonates with me, that's actually great because it will also resonate uh, with other founders and um, is a good starting point to, to build a VC fund. And um, then they invited me to basically join them in, in this journey. And I joined them as the first external member to the team beginning of the year when we're still in the process of raising the fund. And uh, we've been actively investing since. And it turns out building a VC fund is actually also quite an entrepreneurial endeavor. Um, we now have 150 million euro that we're investing in early stage uh, tech in Europe. We uh, particularly like uh, consumer technology businesses. Um, we also invest in B2B companies that um, have very scalable um, sales channels and acquisition channels. And um, we usually try to be an, an early investor in the company. There's some already really successful companies in our portfolio, mostly resulting from the angel investing activities such as Auto One and Flixbus, but um, also more recent companies that we're really excited about, such as uh, Freytop and um, Tourada, for example. Um, so how, how are we different? Um, I think, first of all, and I hope this came across, we're entirely founder-led fund, and this extends beyond just the partners, but to the large extent also within the team. And I think this founder DNA is really important because it really defines how how we work, uh, how we work with our companies, and we actually all still very much like to get our hands dirty. Uh, second, if you take our money, you don't just get access to us as a fund, but you get access to a much, much broader network, which is actually quite unique about our fund is that there's a group of 50 former entrepreneurs and business angels who are investors in our fund that we can match with you depending on what challenge you're facing, and um, they can basically help you at at different stages where um, they support our portfolio companies. And third, I think uh, we invest very, very early. So we're usually the first institutional money in the company. We invest at the same stage where usually business angels come in. But at the same time, we now have this large fund where we can support companies throughout basically the entire journey. So we can invest in your next round and the round after and so on, and really support you throughout the entire stages. And as I said before, it's uh, really never too early to speak with us. Uh, we always really enjoy getting to know great founders, so uh, very much looking forward in meeting you here today. Thank you.